Always. You know, it's you're born and raised. Uh, two hours, two and a half hours from here. Born and raised, three and a half hours. So, mom, my mom has already been up, picked out my furniture and stuff. So it was. Uh, I wouldn't normally. I've gotten that in a long time, so it's, it's been really good. Did you ever think you'd make it back to the state of Mississippi? Never crossed my mind. Uh, as far as would I come back? I know I always wanted to. Uh, you just never know the opportunities. Uh, I remember some stuff was happening over at USM back then. I'm like, man, that would be really nice. But um, I am almost. Ecstatic and happy to be here. Because it was a pretty easy decision whenever you were approached about the job to, to come home. Yeah, it happened quick. Uh, I remember laying on my couch and getting a call and asking the basic simple question, are you interested? Here I am. <laughs> What's it like coming in with two other new coaches on that defensive staff? A little bit different. Now we have to put our minds together and see, okay, what are we going to do? How are we going to do it? Uh, nobody knows the players, uh, so it's it's going to take a little longer than it normally would if it was some other coaches here that knew, and they had their routine, and you just slide right in. It's on that other side. What's it like to have a guy like David Turner who's been here, kind of a veteran, and understands the program? Old vet, man. I've leaned on him from, from recruiting to what happens around here. That's the great thing about when you have – one guy, a couple guys. I've leaned on uh, the offensive guys too, trying to figure out and, and the lay of the land, as they say, uh, which they've been very, very supportive. How do you go about evaluating the talent um, when you have a whole crop of new players that you haven't seen practice or played before? It's nothing new. It's coach. I see him. I see him move and all that. This is this is what I've been doing at this level, uh, higher for since I was 17 years old. So. That part of it doesn't change. Uh, coming back and some guys that More than most coaches, I mean, you have obvious pride in the level of players, it turns out, in the state of Mississippi. What was it like getting back in and now jumping into recruiting Mississippi again? Well, I've been recruiting Mississippi. That's, that's been one of my – that was one of my goals when I first got into coaching. I, I remember having this conversation with Terry Bowden, Ghost Bowden at Akron about, let me recruit Mississippi. Let me recruit. And leaving there and going to Louisville, same thing with Coach Petrino. So I've been here. Uh, I want to say five or ten guys, I'm losing count, how many I've actually came in and, and got or close to it. And having got being here now, like this weekend, having guys that drive up is really, really exciting. And I'm excited about it.